I also like to look at when the students are engaged uh, with my presentation. So if they're not engaged, there's no point uh, really putting that content. So I like to have up-to-date content where I can see that the students are really engaged, they're taking notes. Audience polling, which we really think is a useful thing for students to, to use, to be engaged in class, relied on taking various boxes of clickers, depending on how big your class is, and then hoping that students will hand them back at the end. We tended to lose about 20% each year. So the problem at the moment, uh, international students don't often have the critical thinking or language skills to thrive at Australian universities. Which leads me to ask the question, can ECHO 360 ALP be used to teach critical thinking skills in tandem with course content? Especially when they get it wrong, they really want to know why. And I think that creates amazing learning opportunities uh, where they, you know, they don't like getting it wrong and they really want to know why they got it wrong. Being able to actually sort of tell their lecturers that they are confused, where in the past they probably would have sat there silently, not being able to say a word, too afraid to say anything. Uh, now students just need to press a button and then they can tell the lecturer that they're confused. interactive polling and the, the Q&A can really be used to enhance um, the way the, the teachers and the students can interact with each other and how the students can interact with each other and how we can all interact with the content in new ways.